Today we're going to be taking a look at the Airbed's rear seat air mattress. It's available in blue. It's also available in real tree camouflage. When it comes to camping or late night excursions, one of the biggest mistakes is not having the right sleeping gear. The Airbed's back seat air mattress is your simple solution. It converts your entire back seat area of your full size truck or SUV into a comfortable bed. It's a great alternative to setting up a tent. It simply inflates, you set it in your back seat, and you're good to go. To give you an idea how much it covers in your back seat, its dimensions are 60 inches long, 35 and a half inches wide, and 17 and three quarters of an inch tall. It's gonna fit the contours around our back seat. On this side, it fits around our center console, and it fills the footwell gaps, giving you equal support over the whole air mattress. With it removed, as you can see by design, it's gonna fill that entire footwell area, giving you the support you need. One nice extra that this air mattress includes is an inflatable pillow. Though it is small, it's better than nothing. Its dimensions are about 12 and a half inches long by nine inches wide. It also includes a 12 volt portable pump. This is gonna allow us to quickly inflate or deflate our air mattress. It simply plugs in to the power outlet in our vehicle. It has about a six foot long cord, which is gonna be more than enough to blow up our air mattress next to our vehicle. Now the pump also includes three adapters, one so we can air up our air mattress and two so we can air up our pillow and it has one more to air up some other accessories. When it comes to inflating or deflating your mattress, it's important to note that there are two valves. There's one for the footwell filler and one for the mattress itself. Let's go ahead and check it out. For inflating or deflating, you'll wanna be sure to choose the correct adapter. To deflate the mattress, we'll pull the plug all the way out on both valves. So that's the first one. This one will be for inflating, but since we're pulling it all the way out, got that one started, and then we'll do this one. To completely deflate it and make it easy to fold, we'll use our pump. This will ensure that we take all of the air out of it. I'll go ahead and replace the valve cover on this one. From there, we'll take the rest of the air out of the mattress on the ground. Now we can fold it up. Once we've got it all folded, it even includes a bag so we can easily carry it and stow it. When you're ready to use your air mattress, the pump quickly inflates it. We'll choose our correct adapter, put it on the inflate side, turn it on, and we're ready to go.
Then we'll plug our valves. And we're ready to set it in place. Then when you're ready to put it in, the easiest way I found to do it was to fold it like a taco and push it in place. Then you can just push down. And we're ready to go. Then we're ready to air up that pillow. Put on the valve, and we're ready to go. Finally, it includes a patch kit if you should accidentally spring a leak. And that's gonna complete our look at the AirBeds rear seat air mattress.